Good morning, West Hall. I'm Jacob Taylor. Today is Friday, October 10th, 2014. Before we get started with the news today, um, Connor Legault is out in the hallways doing some interviews with a couple of students. So I'm going to send it over to my uh, co-anchor, personal best friend, and person who would never say anything bad about me, Connor. Thanks, Jacob. We're here in the purple hallway at West Hall High School. We're going to interview a few people about what they think about you. All right. I see a few candidates right here. Sir, can we ask you a question? Uh, sure, yeah, what's up? About, um, what do you think about Jacob Taylor? Like, how does he make you feel? You know, Jacob Taylor, is, he's just really arrogant. And yeah. I just don't like him. You know, just the way he looks, you know, his haircut is just, it, it makes me angry. Yeah. How do you, like, what makes you think that, though? Like, what brings you to this conclusion that he's just a terrible person? Well, you know, the whole I'm Jacob Taylor and you're not thing, it just, it makes me mad. I'm, that's all. Yeah, like, personally, when I'm sitting you, next to him and he wanna, does it. Do you want to know what I think about Jacob, Jacob Taylor? Wait, can you say that again? Do you want to know what I think about Jacob Taylor? Not really. This can is my leave? interview. All right, I'm sorry. Rude? All right. Like, when I'm sitting next to him and he's doing the I'm Jacob Taylor thing, like, you can see that I'm just here and he makes me feel like I'm not there. You know? I know how you feel. It's the same on the baseball field. You yeah, know, he, I was thinking the same thing, too. Sir, sir can you please see the shot? I was... <laughs> Thanks, Connor. Attention all students. The PSAT will be given to current sophomores on Wednesday, October 15th. This test is important because it is a national merit qualifying test. There is no charge to take the test as a sophomore. Freshmen and juniors are also encouraged to take the test. However, there is a fee for $14 for those who are not sophomores. Next Tuesday, the Gainesville Civic Center will be hosting its annual Probe College Fair. There will be tons of colleges represented there between 6 and 8 p.m. Please see Mrs. Maddie or Ms. Ryan in the counselor's office for more details. Are you a putt-putt master? Are you looking for a place to show off your mad skills? Tomorrow, October 11th, from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m., all students, faculty, and staff are invited to come out and play miniature golf at the Oaks on McGever Road for every person playing. The Oaks will make a $2 donation to the Muscular Dystrophy Association on behalf of the Beta Club. The money raised this year will help us to send two children with muscular dystrophy to camp here in Georgia this summer. The cost of play is $5. Please bring cash and pay the Beta Club officer, leader, or sponsor. See you at the Oaks. Attention seniors, early action deadlines are coming up. The early action deadline for UGA and Georgia Tech is next Wednesday, October 15th. The early action deadline for UNG, the Dahlonega campus only, is November 15th. Seniors, make sure to get your applications submitted. FBLA and DECA are starting a canned food drive. These two clubs are participating in the Salvation Army food drive. Listen up, students. Every 10 cans you bring as a donation will enter for a chance to win the iPad. There will be other prizes from the school store and the Spartan print shop, so bring some cans. Do you like fairy tales? Come see your favorite fairy tales with a bit of a twist in Into the Woods tomorrow, October 11th at 7 p.m. Admission is $5 for students and $7 for adults. Attention all students. Make sure you guys follow the West Hall Yearbook Instagram page and tag us in any pictures you think would be good in the yearbook. They will be having a contest each week and will be announcing the winner each Friday. So make sure you tag the yearbook Instagram in your pictures. Attention all Spartans. This weekend, October 10th, 11th, and 12th, we will be having about 2,000 Special Olympic athletes in Hall County participating in bocce, softball, cycling, and golf. These events will take place at the North Hall Park. Lauren Park, and Chicopee Woods Golf Course. We are needing additional volunteers for the weekend. Our Hall County delegation will have 96 athletes competing in bocce and golf. This will be a great opportunity for IB, Beta, and National Honor Society, FCA, and other school clubs to acquire community service hours. If you can come and help out one or all three of the days, please email Stephen Sparks with the Special Olympics Georgia at stephen.sparks at specialolympics.org. 
Mr. Sparks' email will be on the Westside News website for your convenience. Today in Spartan Sports, boys basketball conditioning will be this Friday, October 10th in the school gym. All girls interested in trying out for basketball need to meet in Coach Richardson's room October 20th after school from 3.45 to 4.30. Basketball tryouts will be held October 27th to the 28th from 4 to 6 p.m. If you are interested in trying out, you must have a physical to participate. Tonight, our football team will be playing the East Hall Vikings here in the Hot Gates. The game starts at 7.30 and it's a pink out, so get there and support your Spartans. Check your ID Spartans. These are now part of your dress code. So make sure you have it on at all times when you're in the building. You get the first one free, but if you need to replace it, it'll cost you $7 in the media center. So make sure you don't lose it. That's all for today's announcements. If you would, please stand for the moment of silence to be followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. And as always, West Hall, I'm Jacob Taylor. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, liberty and justice for all.